Hello, uh, beautiful Joyful Lemons. It's Joyful Lemonsaurus here today with another review. So we have the, uh, if you can see it, the set with a, the Takara Tomi set with a Spinosaurus, a baby T-Rex, and a normal T-Rex. So yeah, make sure you enjoy the video, sit back, relax. Uh, subscribe if you want. I'm not forcing you, but yeah. Uh, if you're new uh, to the channel, then maybe you want to subscribe. I don't know, but yeah. If you want, you can subscribe. And I'm. I realize I just forgot the scissors, so I'll be right back in a minute. All right, I'm back with the scissors. And we're gonna cut this open. If you're uh, handling anything sharp, please be careful and ask your parents to help you. But I'm out of breath. But like, uh, I'm gonna try to be as careful as I can. So yeah, I got this out. Look at that. Look yeah, how beautiful that is. So I've ordered, opened it before in Malaysia, but I haven't, I haven't got the figures out yet. So yeah, let's see if we can get them out. So we're gonna snip them open. Oh, there's actually a base to it. Ah, interesting. But anyway, let's... Yep. Okay. We got the Spinosaurus here. Which is probably my most accurate Spinosaurus. Uh, sorry for the lighting. I'm in a room uh, with sunlight. So yeah, sorry for that. But anyway, let's continue. Oh. Okay, this is the baby T-Rex. Oh, looks very cute. Look at that. And then we have the uh, great and iconic uh, Tyrannosaurus Rex, the the adult version. Yeah, uh, kind of stuck here. So let's let's try to get it out again. All right. Still need to cut. Oh, oh. Okay. Sorry, guys. This is taking a while. Yeah, I'm playing. No. No. All right. Uh, so we're gonna have to take this out. Sorry, base. Sorry, box. Uh, I need to get this figure out. So yeah. Uh, okay. And there we go. Oh, yeah, that was loud. Sorry about that. Oh, uh, but I need to get this out from the box. Okay, we got the figures out at least. But it was loud and messy. Just a bit messy, but <laughs> yeah, we got the figures out. Now time. Look, look at the T Rex. Look at, look at that. <laughs> so, 
I'm going to show you a technique that I use. Always cut away from you, yourself. Do not cut in the way of yourself. Like, do not cut this way. Cut this way. Cut away from yourself so that you don't get hurt because I don't want my fans to be hurt. Uh, but <clears throat> firstly, we have the great and iconic Tyrannosaurus. The baby one, which is very weird because there's evidence that the uh, baby Tyrannosaurus was covered in feathers, like everywhere. Uh, but no, it is actually... Uh, it is actually not covered with feathers, and it's all scaly. Can you see that? Yeah, uh... Yeah, it's scaly. But then with the biggin Tyrannosaurus, there is feathers. Which is really cool, and... Yeah, ju it's just a bit, but still really cool. Uh, you can open the mouth like this. And then move the legs. Look at that. And then move the tail up and down. Yeah, uh, Tomy is really good with their figures. This is up to date. And, uh, however, this, in my opinion, is not that accurate, but, you know, I'm not complaining. Still good. Like, still good. It's still very detailed. And you can move the jaw, which is a priority for my dinosaur figures, is for them to have a moving jaw. However, I do have to say, one... A uh, dinosaur that Takara told me, uh, in my opinion, like, you know, got quite, not, not very accurate, but it's fine. It's, it is the great and the biggest theropod dinosaur of all time, the Spinosaurus. For one... Uh, Spinosaurus did not walk on four legs. This was obviously based on the 2014 uh, paper. Uh, but also, they missed out the tadpole-like uh, spines on its tail that to, to help it swim. But all in all, this is probably the most accurate... Uh, depiction of Spinosaurus I have. Well, after I get a more accurate Spinosaurus. But yeah, th this looks cool. I mean, it's not bad. Yeah, uh, I'm going to compare it with a spin another Spinosaurus I have. This is the articulated one. And if you're wondering what happened here uh, to this, now this had two crests, like the Jurassic Park 3 one, but, you know, I got some glue and then made another crest on it, which is on this one. Like you can see there, it's a bit like a roost roosters thing. Like the thing you see on roosters, I'm not an expert on uh, farm animals and chickens, so I don't know what is that called. But yeah, you can move the jaw. Well, kinda. It's a bit for forty now. Oh, can I lick the spider? Do that. And the T Rex, which is also from the same set. That looks like the Jurassic Park version of the T-Rex. Quite, I mean, kinda, but not really. But right now, this kind of reminds me of the Red Rex from the original Jurassic Park toy sets by Kenner. 
<laughs> but anyway, that is the video for y'all. I hope you've enjoyed and have a joyful and jolly day. Bye-bye.